Reality reflects teleological evolution, not Darwinian evolution. Teleological evolution also deals with natural selection that plays a part in it, but not random mutation. It is the purposeful evolving So, what is this talking about? Yeah, over here, uh, the individual says, we stand, don't we, on a delicate edge, gazing into a chasm of the unknown. It's a space that invites us, yet frightens us. Breathe deep, close your eyes. Can you feel it? A silent tug, a whisper, a longing. We stand at the edge of something profound, ga gazing into the vast unknown. We're all set. Where Everyone is ready. So we're ready to go. We're at that. Our next guest right made now. their we're network television debut television. right here on this very program and last year. Really here is their new album here, called like The said, Flood, an and it's been getting excellent reviews. They will be at the Beacon the Theater tomorrow being. night. Ladies and gentlemen, and please welcome back to the show. They might be giants. Teleological evolution versus Darwinian evolution. And this is very important to understand the difference. So reality reflects teleological evolution, not Darwinian evolution. Darwinian evolution has to do with random mutation and natural selection. Teleological evolution also deals with natural selection, that plays a part in it, but not random mutation. It is the purposeful evolving of attributes towards a result. So, uh, there is no randomness involved. You always have to remember, whenever you hear random used in any kind of scientific theory, that's code for we have no effing idea how this works. Because if you think about it carefully, randomness is not an explanation, it is a lack of explanation. So reality you know, reflects why some teleological evolution. You ask no reason. Darwinian evolution. Well, what is the reason? Like teleological evolution by what also deals with if you say it's like random, that plays a part random means, means, but not no random process. mutation. There is no way. It is the purposeful evolving of attributes hurt towards a result. Like, oh, okay, okay. So, oh, it's random. Uh, but but there is no matter. randomness involved. You always randomness have to remember, whenever you uh, hear uh, random, you think any kind of scientific theory, you saying, oh, it happened because it happen and it's no better than just saying well how did the universe reality how did like the universe create teleological evolution? God created not Darwinian evolution well teleological well, evolution also deals with well, well, natural selection the idea the part of God but not random mutation God it is the purposeful God evolving God of God attributes God 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 towards a set up. Result. But if you go, oh, so, how did the universe uh, exist? You go, there is no well, random random involved. You always have to remember, whenever you hear random, you use the uh, kind of scientific theory. Situation. And this is actually what is posited as the so-called cause of the Big Bang, is a random quantum fluctuation. So you can imagine if you say, hey, what created the universe? And someone says, well, God created it. And you go, well, what's the need of God? And, and how does God create things? And by what attributes is God able to create around the existence? There's a lot of problems with that. How did, you know, people, what, how did the universe start? And a scientist goes, oh, well, it was a random quantum fluctuation. People are more apt to be like, oh, oh, okay, a random quantum fluctuation. Uh -oh. it, it, but it's no better than saying God created it. Because randomness is a, it's a mechanism that has no mechanism. It's not a mechanism, it's a lack of mechanism. So it's, it's a it's just, something happened. That's what that is. That is what that is. It's, it's, uh, I don't know, something happened, but we're covered up with scientific evidence. So, Darwinian evolution, while the process of natural selection is absolutely real, random mutation is not. Variations don't just occur randomly, the variations occur according to a certain pattern. And you can kind of imagine it like the growth of a flower. A flower grows according to a specific pattern, not randomly. Now that's not a perfect comparison, 